Uh, yeah, yeah, motherfucker, what? Uh. Kill these niggas, what? Uh, check it, uh, yo. Why some cops said they circle the block? They tryna plot to find a reason to put one in my top. I don't stop, I got my life inside a Rolex watch. So try to reach the fans, go find another joy. What's good? It's your boy Pistons Mike back again on the mic with another video. Now, what if the Pistons got James Book Knight and Deron Sharp on draft night? Deron Sharp is a um, North Carolina. He's from. He played at North Carolina. He's a big man. He's a center. I think he's six foot ten, two hundred fifty pounds. He showed flashes. He played behind two bigs. He did very well. Um, so it's good to see that that he did that well. He did very well, like I said. Very, very, very well. Um, it was good to see him. He averaged some good points. He could rebound the ball. He can block shots. Do a little bit at all. My question is, could he stretch it out to three? <laughs> He got a little mini, but can you stretch it out to the three? Because, you know, all big shoot threes now. So, um, I think he, he's a guy you might take a chance on within the top 25 for sure. Because we need a big man for sure. He's like one of the top big men, maybe two or three. So, you guys let me know what y'all think about them. I think he would be really good for this team. And he could solve our rebounding issues, and he could definitely be a big for the future. And he's definitely got an NBA body, which is a plus. So, on to James Booknight. James Booknight, um, very good score. He would just be coming in to score. Very good as a two car. He would probably replace um, Josh Jackson. Josh Jackson, we know what he is. He's not the best scorer in the world. If I could get rid of Josh Jackson and get a lottery pick somehow, I would do it. Um, not saying somebody trade a lot, but if I could get his salary off draft night in trade, I would definitely see if a team, you know what I'm saying, don't necessarily want to take on the salary, just want cash considerations and you can have the pick, I would do something like that and throw in the second round pick. Stuff happens like that all the time. So, because James Woodnight, he could be one of the best scorers if you put it all together. He's a little too inconsistent. Um, his ball handler's got question. He needs to gain some weight. But if you put it all together, he'd be one dangerous dude. But it's your boy, Pistol. Make, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button button. And I'm out. Peace.